So then we're going to do the same thing. We're going to make nice thin slices out of it. Uh, 
Guys, no pushing, all right? Donna, no pushing, all right? So guys, I'm going to show you guys this pit real quick. Are there any questions while I'm cutting this pit? Nobody has any questions? The mango, not the lime. Anybody else get a chance? You can't eat it today. Or you can't eat it here. You can eat it if you make it at home. This is a mango, no. It's a tropical fruit. I don't work at a restaurant. I work at I work at Johnson and Wales University. Your mom's a chef. Where? Just, just shaking. Where? That's the pit, guys. All right. It's big, right? For that mango, it's a, it's a pretty big pit. All right. So you want to make sure that you cut around that. All right, and if you cut it the way I show you guys, you won't hit the pit. Why do I wear this? So I don't get hair in my food, right? So I don't get any hair in my food. All right, it's not because I have bad hair or anything like that. All right, we want to make sure that we keep our hair up. If you have long hair, like these little whispers over here that you got, all right, bless you. You want to make sure that you put it up when you're cooking food. Okay. What else? My face is nice and clean, right? I don't have any, I don't have a beard or a mustache or anything like that. Uh, what are you laughing at? So, all right, so we want to make sure that we do that. You guys saw this, right? There's some brush. Everybody knows what this is? Baseball glove, right? An oven mitt. All right, whenever we go into the oven or we're cooking something on the stove, we want to make sure we protect our hands, protect ourselves. You know why our jackets are long and, and it's, we work in hot kitchens? So I don't burn my arms. All right? See these guys with the short jackets and they have all these burns up there. So you want to make sure if you're, when I'm cooking in a restaurant around a hot stove all day long, I'll keep my sleeves down. All right? Another thing, guys, hot soapy water all the time in the kitchen. And you don't want to use a sponge. All right? Sponges hold bacteria in them. All right, so if you go home tonight and you see mom and dad with sponges, all right, tell them that there's a lot of bacteria in them and they should be using these dish rags instead. All right, you use these once for each thing, and then you can throw it in the laundry basket, throw it in the washing machine. Okay? Any questions? Anything at all?